So LMTs need a, a way to help their thumbs. That gets so much use. And one of the important things to me seems that you need to use your thumbs in a way that helps them while you're helping your clients. So that you're not like, I don't know, so that the excuse is never there that, well, I don't have time for it or whatever. I mean, self-massage can be happening while you are making money, while you are doing what you do. Like, um, let's see. Well, this is a pretty good exercise. It's pretty easy. You just move them around. If you can push pretty hard, it ends up helping. And uh, going in a circle is pretty fantastic, too. So you make sure to get, like, the whole width of each of the webs of your thumb. Um, let's see. There's another really good exercise. Oh, yeah. This one's really great for your clients, too, because it lets, uh, what? come on. Okay, well, this one's really great for your clients because it helps them open their toes up, and it also lets you exercise your thumb. It's pretty fantastic, and it feels so great to do it yourself. Or just, yeah. I mean, and, and the thing is, it feels great for both. It feels great for my thumb. I'm getting a lot of room in there. Ah, and I just, I like need the toe spreading. It's so important. Ah, uh, let's see. There's got to be another cool couple of tricks. Um, oh, yeah. That one that I was just kind of miming a little while ago. Or, not miming, whatever. Um, you like use this part of your thumb right here, and you, well, let me show you. You like do a good job of pushing and spreading your thumb open, or your thumb joint, as well as such cool pressure, like applying, applying this ring of pressure to the top of your leg. I mean, you can do this on like an arm. You can do this pretty much uh, anywhere. On a client's body or on your own. I mean, one of the most important things is just remembering to, to massage yourself when you have a second. You know, you're, you're like waiting for the client to, I don't know, get undressed or something, you know? Or you're waiting for a client that's five minutes late. Like, I try to use all the time before a client shows up after I'm set up and like ready to go if they're late if you know I've got five minutes I try to use all the time for stretching or all the time for I don't know pulling on my hair or like you know getting my uh, facial sinus cavities a little bit more cleared out there's a lot of important stuff to do but really the like really important changing game changer is just remembering that you need to work toward health for your clients but that you need to work toward health for yourself you need to or else you can't help your clients if you're not grounded you can't ground your clients that's all there is to it all right peace